Shalom, I'd like to say all praises due to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Rakakadash, double honors to the elder apostles of great millstone, peace and blessings to all your brothers teaching in truth and sincerity throughout the four corners of the globe underneath the standard and the banner of Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai. This is Tyler Yaw, GMS Boston, coming back once again, you know, uh, this this uh, uh uh rent that Jake has, all right. This is a surefire way to let the hopeful elect know that the words of the holy scriptures are living, okay. And, uh, you know, and the rent is tangible, okay? So I got a couple of scriptures that I'm going to just let it go. And uh, uh, be in the thoughts of those that meditate on the scriptures, man, okay? Because we're, we're coming to a close, all right? In this uh, wicked kingdom, okay? And there's only so many times that the Lord is going to allow the men of the Lord to tell you to come out of the ways of this, this place, man, okay? Of Babylon the Great. And you can't, you can't take anything with you into the kingdom of heaven but your, yourself, Okay? In your in your spirit, and that's what I mean by self. It's your it's your spirit, man. Okay. When you get beamed up in those chariots, uh, uh <clears throat> your your earthly treasure won't come with you. All right. So, what these uh, Negroes down here? Okay. When I say down here, I mean on the earth. In this kingdom, Babylon the Great, and abroad, if you're still thinking about a generational uh, gap, wealth, okay, then your mind is still locked in Babylon the Great, all right? So I'm going to play this. It's them. We're not going to get no respect in this country without the cash. We ain't going to get no respect in this country without having money in our community. It just ain't gonna happen. And he's right. Okay. We're not. And it wasn't meant for us to have that abundance of of wealth here in captivity. Okay. And the Lord let these uh Negroes get this wealth on the left hand side. To be an example of what not to be. So let me bring out the uh, scriptures, okay? So I can shed some some light on uh, on what's being said. Okay, this is Proverbs thirteen and eight. It says, "The ransom of a man's life are his riches, but the poor heareth not rebuke." Okay. So this man, this man is, is stuck and held hostage by what he has in his pocket, all right? And it's, it's evident, all right? He's still trying to hold on to what he has gained in this uh, wicked kingdom and uh, try to, uh, 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 so to speak, try to throw throw back a rope okay to help the the poor but the poor heareth not rebuke okay so when we out there on the highways and byways all right we telling you how to get the real riches from the heavenly father from the scriptures man but you got to take the stiff rebuke that comes with it. 
okay? And it's gonna, the more scriptures I read, it's going to be clear, all right? It says, the light of the righteous rejoice, but the lamp of the wicked shall be put out, okay? And that's, that's the evidence as well, man, because the men of the Lord, we don't have nothing, man, okay? We just have enough to, to get by day to day, okay? And if we do have a few extra shekels, you know, it's to the brotherhood or it's to maintain uh, something that's that's benefiting the brotherhood, okay? Including your, your own household and, you know, brothers that's close, far and near, all right? But this this man's kingdom is going to fall, man. This this Esau Edom's kingdom is going to fall, okay? That's why you can't have any hopes and dreams of of being in the position of being wealthy like Satan, man, okay? The great Satan, Esau Edom, okay? Flush that dream down the toilet, man. You don't want that. It says, only by pride comes contention, but with the well-advised is wisdom. Wealth gotten by vanity shall be diminished, okay? But he that gathered by labor shall increase, okay? And that's what you see the men of the Lord doing, all right? We're not doing this for vanity. We're doing this for for the Lord, uh, 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 the Lord's return, okay? So we doing what the uh, parable of Matthew said with the talent. The talent, okay. That's what we're doing. That's why we're in this race that we uh that we run, okay. But people like Ice Cube and these other celebrities, they got that fame, okay. That's vanity right there, man. So their difference is gonna. And when this kingdom goes, all right, this man, uh, fame goes, his wealth goes, all right, and pretty much everybody's going to be on the same, same, um, playing field, so to speak, okay? Let me go to the next scripture. All right, let's go to, uh, uh. Ecclesiastes 12 and 10 it says the preacher sought to find out acceptable words and that which was written was upright even words of truth the words of the wise are as goals and as nails fastened by the masters of assembly which are given from one shepherd okay so we out there proclaiming that the kingdom of heaven is coming and this wicked kingdom is falling man you should give it, man. All right. And we tell you, we tell you how to get into the kingdom of heaven. Okay. We tell you that you got to repent and turn your face back to the heavenly father. And forget the ways of Esau, Edom. All right. And there's a uh, kingdom Babylon the great. Okay. Without a doubt. Okay. Let me go here real quick. Let's go to uh, Proverbs 23 and 3. It's Proverbs 23. Because, you know, Ice Cube, he went to, uh, went to speak to the Republicans about his uh black contract <laughs> and uh you know people got on his ass man okay let me let me show you a little bit what people were saying man okay let's just go back here it's not all right let's see As you can see, it says I was prepared 
and this was uh, written by Ice Cube on his tweet on his Twitter page. It says, "I was prepared to hide the plan right there, but I felt like I shouldn't be defending his plan by going point by point. That's on him, not me." The interview covered a lot. This is cherry picking. Okay, so the, you know that's that's uh that's part of it right there. All right, and you're not gonna know that. Satan's plan because he doesn't want you to know all right it says you don't understand why I don't know Trump's plan like the back of my hand okay it's his plan my plan is to contract with black America compare the two for yourself and see what they took okay and then you got uh people writing and it says this is painful Ice Cube has no idea what he's talking about <laughs> Bro, why do you think that some someone would deny who denies systematic racism would do anything to fix it? Okay. I guess Q flip flop just like his own lyrics and his song, true to the game. So hard to believe. And it's not because he's trying to hold on you you know like the uh, scriptures say, you can't serve two masters, man. Either you serve one or you hate the other. Okay? And that's what he's trying to do. So, because he's on the fence, the Lord's going to put the screws to him, man. Okay? And just like our uh, first king, okay, Masha, who wrote the uh, five books, which his name is uh, translated in English as Moses. Okay. Moses didn't ride the fence, man. He made a decision. Okay. He, he came over to the side of his uh, his fellow uh, brethren, which were the Israelites. Okay. So, Q, you're going all about it the wrong way, man. You're going about it all the wrong way. That's why I'm going to read this. Okay. <clears throat> it's Proverbs 23. When thou sittest to eat with a ruler, consider diligently what is before thee. All right. And put a knife to thy throat if thou be a man given to appetite. And Cube is one of those people. Okay, be not desirous of his dainties, for they are deceitful meat. They will not to be reached, cease from their own wisdom. All right. Wilt thou set thine eyes upon that which is not? For riches certainly make themselves wings. They fly away as an eagle towards heaven. And yeah, how, 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 do, you, how do you propose that? Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, when they do acquire this so-called uh, um, wealth, all right, <clears throat> which we have have no no type of money managing skills because we have never had money. Okay, so you give give this wealth to Jake in the hood, and it's gonna be a project filled with. Uh, Gucci wearing, uh, high and in fashion, no level people, man. Okay, that's supposed to be on the top, with a ruler class mentality, but they they don't have that. That's a that's a a, a, <laughs> a recipe for disaster in itself, man. Okay. Soon as they get the wealth, man, it's gonna fly right out of their hands, like the scripture just said, man. Okay. It says, "Eat thou not the bread of him that hath an evil eye, neither desire thou his dainty meats, for as he thinketh in his heart, so is he. Eat and drink, saith he to thee, but his heart is not with thee." All right. 
So you can't trust these devils going to come and cute. I don't I don't know what you're trying to do, but the scripture just said it all. Just said it all. All right. I'm going to get this scripture. Okay, I got Proverbs 3 and uh, 5. Okay, because if you're looking at uh, all the brothers' videos, okay, in GMS, man, we're, we're telling you what, to, what you should do, man. Don't trust in voting. Don't believe anything these politicians say. Don't have your uh, uh, your mind rooted in black communities. Okay, all that we're not we're not advocating any of that. But this is what we advocate: Proverbs three and five. It says, "Trust in the Lord with all thy heart, thine heart, and lean unto thine own, and lean not onto thine own understanding." Okay, because it's gonna end bad for you, man. Okay. And we we gonna see what's gonna happen to the uh, innumerable amounts of of wealthy or so called wealthy black people in America when this uh when this chip comes out. Okay, we know they're gonna get stuffed with it. That's why they don't really have an answer for you now because they they're still gonna serve the the uh, uh the unrighteous math master. At the end of the day, man, okay, they're not going to change their ways. Therefore, they can't be wise and give you the word of truth like the man of the Lord are doing, okay? It says, in all thy ways acknowledge him, and he shall direct thy paths. Be not wise in thine own eyes. Fear the Lord and depart from evil, okay? And that's that's the problem that they're having, man. They can't depart from evil, Okay? Let's get this real quick, and then I'm going to close it out. First Timothy uh, 6 and 9 says, But they that will be rich fall into temptation in a snare, and into many foolish and hurtful lusts, which drown men in destruction and perdition. Okay? And that's what we're getting ready to see, man. Okay? Anybody that want to continue to be rich, okay? You got to go to Revelation, the 13th chapter. Okay? And read around the, what is it, the 13th verse on down. Okay. And then you got to go to Revelations 14 after that. All right. Let's see uh, uh, what's going to happen to you after you take the mark of the beast, man. Okay. That's what we're getting ready to see. It says, for the love of money is the root of all evil. Okay. Which I just finished reading. They can't depart from evil. So they're not going to be able to tell you uh, the true uh, words of the Holy Scriptures, man. Okay. Which will some covet after they have erred from the faith the faith and pierced themselves through with many sorrows. Okay. It says, But thou, O man of God, flee these things and follow after righteousness, godliness, faith, love, patience, and meekness. Fight the good fight of faith, lay hold on eternal life. Okay. So, all those people that, that's rich, that's talking about generational wealth. And, and, you know, we got to vote and we need to put this. Pe these people are done. That's it. Cube is out of here. LeBron James is out of here. Will Smith is out of here. Nick Cannon is out of here. Raya Carey is out of here. All these, all these jakes with money. They're not going into the kingdom of heaven because, like the scripture said, man, 
okay? The rich man had to sell everything, okay, and join Yahweh Shai, man. And he walked off. Okay? So don't be don't be fooled by by these uh these so called wealthy black people in America, which are Israelites indeed, but they sold themselves, okay, to the left hand side. In the last two verses, eleven and twelve, man, it tells you what a man of the Lord Okay. Shall do, man. And Aquath. Okay. So, hey, I'm telling you, man, this, this, the screws are turning. All right. And it's going to get tighter and tighter. And this is the, the last result, man. This is what we have to do. I'm going to read verse 11 and 12 again. It says, But thou, O man of power of the Lord, okay, flee these things and follow after righteousness, godliness, faith, love, and patience, and meekness. Fight the good fight of faith. Lay hold on eternal life, whereunto thou art also called. And has professed a good profession before many witnesses. Okay. So you gotta you gotta do the work, man. You gotta do the work, Akwath. You're supposed to be uh 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 on to your husband, okay? And submissive, okay, doing what you ought to do, okay. And man, you're supposed to be pushing the word of the Heavenly Father. Okay. So in that day, the Lord can, can have mercy upon you. If it's his will. All right. So with that, I want to say all praises due to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rakakadash, and double honors to the elder apostles of Great Millstone. Peace and blessings to all your brothers teaching the truth and sincerity throughout the four corners of the globe. Underneath the banner and the standard of Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai. Don't take the chip. Don't be like them. All right. Don't be like uh, these so called celebs chasing uh, a fake FRN. Okay. Shalom.